Hey guys, Cruel Blind Wave. I'm Eric. I'm Kevin. I'm Aaron. And we're here with a new movie reaction. This is a crew pick, and we are watching the uh, newly released here on HBO Max, mm -hmm. The King's Man. Indeed. Which is a prequel to The King's Men. Uh, I definitely remember when we were watching this trailer, uh, and people were like, you should see this trailer for this movie called The King's Man. I remember getting it and being like, oh, <laughs> yeah. The King's Men. That's what it is. Okay. I yeah. thought it was like a sequel to The King's Speech or something. It wasn't. That would be interesting. I don't remember the trailer. You remember the trailer? I don't know if I was in it. It's Maybe you weren't. been a long time well, ago. Well, you wouldn't have seen The Kingsman uh, no. at that point I either, haven't. right? Which you can go check out Aaron's first reaction to both The Kingsman 1 and 2. Um, I need to do, I haven't watched 2. Uh, I mean, I have in the theaters, <laughs> but I didn't, I uh, wasn't in the reaction. So it's been a while since I've watched it. I need to rewatch it. But this, from what I understand, is a prequel. So maybe I don't need to. Kingsman hmm. 2 is really cool. Yeah. You like this? Mm -hmm. I had a cool car fight. I like that one a lot. It did have the a cool car, car fight. Car was fight really, really good. good. And then there was the, the hamburger stuff. And that yeah. I don't know about that. So. Well, we hope that you guys are excited for us to check out The Kingsman. And we are excited for you to check out the subscribe button, which is down below this video. Please click that uh, because it's going to help us out a lot this year for mm -hmm. reasons you don't even know. Yeah. But once you click it, you will one step closer. Tell them. No, we can't tell them. I really want to. Calvin, Calvin. Just take a bite. Take a bite. And we're going to take a bite of the button get started with this movie. Your Grace? Is that dude that loves Starlord? Voldemort. Oh, gosh. Huh? <laughs> My chin is shit, but I can't scratch it. He said Your Grace, right? Yes. So he's a lord. Or royal. royal. Or that. Actually, no. Yeah, it would have to be royal. Oh, what? Mass graves. Thank you, pardon, sir. But these concentration camps are the reason we're winning this war. This way. Fuck. <gasps> hey, I know this guy. Wow. Our knight in shining armor. Charles Dance. Man, I wish he was cutting up a deer. King Arthur and his noble knights were still here. Of course. Which one would you be? I like this guy's found blades. <laughs> scabbard sheath. I'm not sure what it is. The mighty Merlin. I'm not quite sure if it's long enough to be a scabbard. But it's definitely, it's definitely a sheath. Emily! Oh! Oh, what? Uh, they, they sh who shot him? Oh, but this guy's badass. Who is shooting? Where? Oh, a sniper in the bush. No! Oh! They did kill her. Yep. Damn. Protect us. Protect him from this world. Never let him see war again. In 1902? He's gonna have a hard time. Promise me. Keeping that promise. Promise. It's a quite on everyone. Mm-hmm. How? I promise. Train the boy. He's the chosen. There. We didn't see it until it got close. But if your maiden blood yet sailor? Well, if God wanted none to fly, he would have given him wings. Yes, I suppose. Try Father's car. Mm -hmm. You haven't any wheels. <laughs> Has that cane from the shot? Oh. Yeah. Oh. In bow. Nanny Watkins. My study in five minutes. Oh, it's that kind of not bow. Your opinion behind closed doors is one thing, Polly, but I will not tolerate such demonstration out of my household. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I love it, Eric. But you seem to have a problem with Conrad traveling there, or anywhere for that matter. Protect 
protect him from this world. No, from war. The difference. You said world, world two. No, they said war. Not world war. It's not even world war one. Not yet. world two. Not world one. Oh, he's got the marks, the scar on his shoulder. Mm-hmm. Oh, they both got. Can you fight with right? only one arm? Oh yes. If I had someone left to fight. Dang. Yeah. Whoa. Show us. Do you really think a knife can beat a bullet? This is how people are fighting nowadays. Now please don't. Just <laughs> shove that out of his hand for no reason. Kingsman, world's finest tailor. And guns. And shoe knives. And explosive cigarette lighters. Conrad. You're going to need that shooting suit after all. <laughs> goofy smile. That is a goofy smile. Whoa. That's a cool mountaintop thing. Weather top. Yeah, what the hell is this? Is Whoa. Is this what? Is it an elevator? Is it a mine? A mine. What? This isn't a mine. Run, goats. To where? They're on the top of a plateau. They can climb down that in two seconds. They will die. They just can go free down. They will. Fucking crazy. They're, they're good not men in like fantasy, like D&D. They probably make the best walls. Yeah. The question I now have is, can I trust you to behave like them? Me too. Open the boxes in front of you. <gasps> the Baron. Hey. Yeah. These rings will be the symbol of membership to my flock. Put them on, and you will share in our successes. But break my trust, and inside you will find my final gift to you. A tortoise. Am I not worthy of a better animal? Hey, turtles are cool. Putin, I have a bear. I will have to exchange it with you. Yes, Prince. I will be the great bear of Russia. Take what you believe is yours. And Rasputin here. <laughs> As like my beloved Angus. <laughs> Always butting and fucking. Oh, Angus. We're gonna kill him. No! Oh, Angus! But do not mistake fondness for weakness, you late Russian fuckstack! As everybody knows. I don't like Shepard now. Uh, Jay? Oh, it's a hook. To Shepherd's Creek. I want to see his face. I kept thinking that one girl was a uh, Egrit. 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 But I was like, I feel like I know her, and that's the first thing I think of. I don't know who she is. Wait, was this guy's name? Prince. Is he one of the guys that killed Frank? Frank uh, Bear. Ferdinand. In a parade. There it is. Does that make sense to you? It's thawing here. Uh, no. It bounces. Oh, those poor people back there. There were like failed attempts, right? There were. Yeah. He threw a grenade and it bounced. We know this, Eric. But it bounced off an umbrella. I didn't know that. Yeah. They get him eventually. Thanks for the reassurance, Calvin. Don't worry, Eric. He dies horribly. Take the first lift. Right there. He's gonna turn right in front of you. That's crazy. Oh, they got you got both. But how did they know it was him? Huh? Not very subtle with a giant. He had a feather. really tiny name tag. And thankfully, we have our own King George to help keep the peace. <laughs> Charles Dance is so much taller than him. Mm-hmm. I don't trust that guy. Okay, that's the guy from Look at East this. India Trading Company. Three young cuts. Oh, yeah, you're right, it is. Yeah. The pirates. The Rasputin. The soul of Russia is safe in your hand. Huh? <laughs> 
<laughs> I want evil, then I will have it. That mustache. <laughs> the transition to mustache. <laughs> mustache. The object of war is not to die for one's country, but to make the enemy die for theirs. Jeez. You're wrong. That was a the whole real world. quote, I believe. Fix the band. Man, that's just so sharp. Why are they broken? That was a really cool shot. No, fix them to your weapons. Oh my so that gosh, you can run man. down the field and get shot. Dude, the wave back and then the death back. Oh. Jeez. I guess you shouldn't have done that. Jeez! They weren't great. Not even I. At warfare. I mean, I should say, they were great at warfare. Objective killing them. I men. thought it would take a decade for us to achieve. Has taken yeah. two short years. What a shot. That was a hell of a sequence. Yeah. yeah. Oh my Europe's God. resources. And millions have died pointlessly. Look at how big those bullets yeah. We have broken the trust between the people and the inbred monarchs inbred monarch. who only rule due to their fortune of birth. Do you know who hates King George more than the Kaiser? You? Me. Yeah. The English oh. monarchy. Thy will be done, my ship. Hmm. Thy will be done. <laughs> Who is Shepard? It's so familiar. Like you, I wanted to serve my country. But soon I began Whoa. to question oh, what first person. we have to take the land, riches, <clears throat> and the lives of people who were only defending their homeland. Wow. Yeah, I agree with you. I killed. I killed a piece of myself. That's what happens when you make horcruxes. Yeah. You dare to risk your son's life! You must come to your senses now! What? Rasputin is a mystic. My dear cousin Conrad. It has been too long since we last saw each other, and I'm sorry I'm only right. Oh, that's uh, Felix or whatever. He has the Tsar under his spell. Both Jafar and mm -hmm. Opium. What? And has persuaded him to withdraw from the war. The Tsar intends to announce this. Cousin Felix sends his regards. Oh. <laughs> I hope your father's influence can help. It's gonna go. Yeah. Uh. Oh no, a U boat. Subs. Cool <sighs> shot. Shepard! Is that the button to shoot? <laughs> okay. Dude, what a shot! Five Wait, million. where'd Morton go? My God, forgive me. Oh! Good thing Conrad didn't go. Yep. <clears throat> I think Morton is the mole. Why did you say that? You think he jumped overboard? Yeah. Made sure he was reading in his bunk. Your incessant need to protect me will not redeem your own failure to protect mother. Mm. Let's see the type of stuff he was up to back then. You <laughs> say these two, they know what they're doing. About time. <laughs> we spent Welcome to the spent My reputation is of a man not wanting to be involved, which means that my character finds it much easier to be involved unnoticed. Just it's like Bruce Wayne. It is time for us to kill Gregory Rasputin. 
I love the line. It's a really good line. Yeah, I like that. You got poison Rasputin twice. Once for him, once for his dick. He's legendarily large. He's like gliding. You see his legs moving at all? No, I don't. No, he literally is gliding. <laughs> you can't see his legs. Like his feet. Steps. I see you've mastered the Betty Oscar glide. Why don't you glide over there and get me a fucking drink? <laughs> but it's a long way to come for a Christmas party. Well, for me, yes, but not for my son. It was certainly a lot more fun than I am in these dark days. <laughs> <laughs> Gulp. I only make decisions when my stomach is full or my balls are empty. <laughs> Well, thank God dinner has been served. <laughs> <laughs> That's really funny. We like to fuck like tigers. Why tigers? <laughs> Your reputation precedes you. Or if you know so much about my reputation, put your leg in my lap. I may be able to fix it. Here, don't hear somewhat bright, of course. Hmm. Uh, there we are. Trousers off. He <laughs> looks so uncomfortable. <laughs> he looks so undignified. <laughs> You can start from like a side. It's really good. Mm. Just right in the middle. Very English. Yes, very English. That's mm. how I eat corn. Exactly. Cob and all. Aren't you turned on? <laughs> <laughs> No, actually, it's comforting. <laughs> <laughs> I'm told he's been influenced. Good, now we're getting somewhere. If you what really technique. want your leg fixed, tell me the truth. Why are you here? I'm here because... 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 because, because I'm going to I apologize. <laughs> Your cake did not agree with that. Oh. Ah, we must ice your leg. Who we'll put that down? Only two minutes in the cold water and you will be like a new man. What? Is he going to use it to like, cut a hole in the ice water? Yeah. Yeah, you know, shove him in there and kill him. Huh? Probably. God. A lot of almonds in Bakewell tart. To hide the smell. What other ingredients in Bakewell tart? No idea. I'm not a cook. Well, I am. And I also know what else smells like cyanide. Cyanide! cyanide. No! If you really All right, we go in now. You'd know I'd take a little poison for breakfast to keep myself immune. Now that's more like time to dance on your grave. Go <laughs> oh. 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 I don't know. <laughs> Up his back like crocodile Dundee. Oh. Oh, this is fucking cool. Oh, I love it. <laughs> I want to see more of that. Dude, 
sweet. <laughs> I like his movements. Dude, the Gorog would be so good! <laughs> <He's> like, <"Man." laughs> oh! Sweet. Oh. Very nice. Ooh. Shit. Oh, he has poison in there, doesn't he? Uh, opium. Oh, yeah. Yeah, but he's gonna get him real high. You gotta help him. Have Polly come in to shoot him. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it shut the other hand. Blade. Like Polly does. Shoot me. One shot. <laughs> I love this style so much. And the music's so, so good. So, Russian dance, isn't it? Yeah. Oh, Stone Cold Stunner! Oh, oh my, my gosh! My God! <laughs> Twist it. Twist it in, like, his hand. Oh, man. Into the water. Him under the ice. Uh. They had such a simple assassination plan. <laughs> well, yeah, Rasputin was originally like he was shot, poisoned, stabbed, mm -hmm. drowned. <laughs> they just did it all. Yeah. <laughs> Amazing. So put your trousers on. Oh, he's back! He'll be alright. He just needs to. <laughs> he was drowned! <laughs> Eventually they drowned and quartered him, I think. <laughs> Polly. There's a shot. Why is it that boys are always so messy? Pick him up. It's time to go. <laughs> yeah, that's a great fight. <laughs> you have got to be fucking kidding me! Oh! Man, he's never actually Leave the girls alone, man. I want you to pick up. Where Rasputin fades. Man, that guy's bald. Comrade Lenin. Yes, Lenin. When my revolution is complete, the flock's lamp will be so powerful. You one problem will be finding my equal to balance from the right. I'm glad that we can finally see eye to eye. Well, we can. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, it does. What's the secret? Looks like Carrie Ellis. Sir, I'm not doing a damn thing till I have undeniable proof. Douglas, statesman on the rocks, please. Statesman. <laughs> statesman on the rocks. That was fun. Sop. What's your name? One's Corporal Reed Sop. Follow me. Oh, what the fool, Sop. <laughs> <laughs> oh, hell. He'll appreciate what he has to say. And your name, sir? Good question. 
It's a complicated answer. I can only tell the Duke in person. What a scurvy to me. That's just going to sound stupid. <laughs> According to Conrad, I'm Lancelot. You're Merlin. And I'm requesting an audience with King Arthur. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm trying to keep a track of all the timelines and who could be showing up. I've swapped places with Archie Reed, the man in front of you. Please ensure my actions don't get him into any trouble. Tomorrow I finally fulfill my wish to go to the front. And in the meantime, I enclose a poem, which I thought you might appreciate. Um, he's gonna die, isn't he? You fight! One step forward! March! Five more brave volunteers, sir. Excellent. <laughs> it's terrible. Yep. Uh oh, they're looking for him too. Oh, he'll fire. So it's dark. a stalemate, yeah. They both can't fire. Yeah. Because then they'll all die. Put your guns down, fight with knives. This is the worst shit. <laughs> Oh my gosh. Damn. That's actually pretty cool because you block most with your hand. Sure. If I keep the bay in that, get some range. Four, five, yeah, six, I seven. definitely would. Seven and seven, isn't it? It's the hell of a scene. It is. <laughs> you gotta go over dead bodies. Stay so low. It's silent. So silent with the other fights. I know it's really and no music, just fully sound. Ugh. Just that low rumble. Ah, Jesus! Oh, he mumbled with his screams. Jeez! Now you understand what your father feels. Oh, Dang. oh man, I love that move right there. Oh, nice. That's really good. Fuck yeah, it is. Switch. You did knife training with the uh, Shola. Yep. You got like a hammer or something. It is a hammer. You heard it? It's just because it. Saved his life. Damn. Stay there. Oh, Holy shit. Yep, you gotta oh run. Oh my god. Oh, that's. Oh no. What a scene. Jeez, man. Mm hmm. Same size. Thank God for you. Hey. Wait, was that the spy? That's the yeah. spy. That's leg blown off. It's comforting him. He's missing a leg. It's crazy. I know. Oh, we go to a hero's world. Hmm. I can't carry it for you. But I can't carry you. Come on. Will he not get shot? As long as I couldn't see him, I guess. French warfare is so fucked. Ooh! Oh, shit, mortars. Here comes the booms. Oh, oh my god, get there. <laughs> so far. Oh! Damn! Fuck. All well, the info's there. Are they both dead? Like the guy's dead. Isn't it? Probably. Even that, I'd ask him. Ask him. He'll explain everything. He took the full force of that blast, sir. Yeah, but at least you made it back, son. I tell you, if I am worth the Victoria Cross, I don't know what is. What's your name, soldier? Archie. I was called Archie. Archie, did you say? Yeah. That's right. 
Lance Corporal Archery, it's a friend of mine, and I've been looking for him all night. So who are you? Yes, yes, yes. You're right. There's a simple explanation. I'm not Archie. Fucking really. German spy. I can't... Oh my god. I was kind of thinking it was going to go this way, and then I thought, oh, it's not going to go this way. Yeah, I know. Conrad succeeded where we all failed. One death to save millions. Oh, God. There's a gun on there! Oh, gun blade. I like a man who admit to his mistakes. I do. Huh. But I like more a woman who can fix them. Have our American friend DuPont get Marta into DuPont, the DuPont. Mm -hmm. Time for you to work your magic on the prince. <laughs> Marta, now go on. It's time to show the president who the real boss is. It looks like his head. Who is it? <laughs> I don't know. I keep hearing Scrooge McDuck. <laughs> Probably is. <laughs> Neither do I. <laughs> I wanted to give you this for Conrad. Tori Press. Be the man your son would have been. Forgive me, my lady. My heart is broken as well. Holly. Holly. I do not accept your resignation. But I will accept a very strong cup of tea. Need a strong one. You can make that whole organization based off his son's Code names for names. his. Yeah. The Kingsman used to just be a place you get tailored suits. He's got the glasses on. <laughs> Feeling better, Polly. <laughs> so, what have I missed? We followed your last sober order <laughs> and extended our network to the White House. Okay. I don't know how to proceed. We're meeting to discuss her new demands. I see. She was very good. And uh, she suggests we make an alarm at three o'clock. Mm-hmm. Still got the umbrella cane. So they're holding something hostage over his head kind of thing? Probably. Aha! Look at those horns! Rest in peace, Angus. Who names a goat Angus? A shepherd. It should be a bull's name, right? Six men guarding the village. You can call it that. It means that one can jump out of a plane safely. So, <laughs> tomorrow at dawn, I'll fly the plane over the mountain and Shola will jump out. Who? <laughs> 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 yeah, right. I am the only one who can fly, so... But you wouldn't have to land the play. you just have to land yourself. It's true. So fly and just jump oh, out of the plane? Uh, yep. Would be bad form to ask a man to do something that I wouldn't do myself. <laughs> All right, Shara. Get ready for my signal. Should we go at dawn? I like the underbarrel. Flare. Flare. Like the underbarrel shotgun that they have on their pistols. Wow. 
Wow. Coasting. No. A good fuck. No. Nice spinning. That's a good oh trick. Oh my gosh. Well, at least his legs work. This is why two people should have done this. Yeah. One to fly and one to jump. He's gonna fall through. He's. I think he's trying to fall through. Yeah. Yeah. This point to be good. I just hear a little more. <laughs> Sweet! Oh, golly! Out the side. Thanks for gonna notice that plane. Oh, oh my gosh! That's the plane! Great shot. Get away from the plane! Insane shots. I really did that. Oh, my gosh. Subtlety! He's gonna get, like, crashed through Going the barn. Going pretty fast. Oh, Hope he gosh. makes it. <gasps> Angus! That's not Angus. That's not Angus, it's the other one. Angus. Oh, shit! Fuck! Oh, fuck! Oh, my gosh! Oh, damn! Well, at least the parachute caught on something. Maybe a goat. <gasps> damn, I told you, Aaron. They can climb this fucking mountain! They can climb the mountains like crazy. It's insane. They can go up what you think is sheer walls. <laughs> look, look at this thing! <laughs> I fucking told you! What the fuck? That's CGI, it's not real. No. But they no, can! It's, for real. it's a miniature, but they did it for real. No, <laughs> yep. He's gonna have nothing holding him now. Yeah, but he's gonna have nothing oh, pulling him down either. Oh, man. He would have for sure died there. What happened to the goat? You're gonna have to do the, the goat trick. It died. They, they killed the goat? He ate it. Oh, there it goes. Fucking crazy ass goat. How many goats do you think have died doing this shit? Oh, a few, but less than you would think. They'll be doing that shit. Eagles will come and grab their horns and throw them off the mountain and eat them. Yeah. Jesus, man, ah. this man can't kind of catch a break. No breaks. Grab a goat. Wow. What the hell? He jumped off the pit. Oh, my gosh. Voldemort doesn't get any breaks. <laughs> Don't. Maybe he's gonna give him a horn. Oh fuck, man! He can't catch a break. Also, what they do? It's only things that, it's only two things that goats do. Yeah, grab him. He's gonna have to pull back yep. or die. Yep. Quest sequence. All right, good. Now throw him off the mountain. This movie did such fantastic set pieces. Okay. He's mad at people. Fire your throw. flare. No, he has to get the, the, the lift. Run! All the way to the run! Run! <laughs> Do bunt! Man, that would be terrible. Yeah. I would hate that so much. Jesus. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Shoot the player. Ah, oh, cool. There's the signal. Get to the lift. I'll copy. Obviously, he has control of the lift. Oh! Jesus! Mm. That girl's a good shot. Oh, he died. It's like a cheese house. You're in, right? Oh, yeah. Oh, jeez! I know! He got stabbed in the leg and just yelled at Find me the biggest man for this movie. Oh my gosh. The cheese, no! It's bulletproof! It's not bulletproof. It's not. But it is sh sh shredded now. Oh! Up, oh, you're out of blades. Give me the foot! Give me the foot! It broke off! Did it? Oh, yeah! I thought he still had one. Oh! Ooh. That's a jump. Oh! That's why you have a blade and not bullets. Ugh! Ugh! Oh, I love how the camera shakes when he takes a step. Oh, shit. Who the hell is that guy? Oh, my God. <laughs> love how dumb the American sounds. <laughs> I hope he can't get his finger in the trigger guard. Uh oh. Stop fucking about! Get on that counterweight! 
Oh man, are we gonna send the other guy down while he holds the rope? No Ooh, way! Prince of Persia! <laughs> That's a great. Wow! Yeah, goes the other guy. Fight me, bud! <laughs> oh, nice. Okay, they got the negative now. Oh, oh it's man. a heavy head. What a sequence. This plan hasn't exactly gone by the numbers. He never does. <laughs> it's time to cut off the head. Just show me the head first. Well, how do you get down? Is there another round after the lift? Oh. All the good. Oh! <laughs> Damn! Holy shit! <laughs> Damn! Oh, good thing he turned him in time. Yep. I love that. Nice. Thing. Not me. Ralph finds like a like an action hero in this. Right. It's great. You, Duke. I form a group of swordsmen. Yes. What say we end this shite as gentlemen? Yes. You better have a sword After mask all, thing on. Manners maketh man. Manners maketh man, huh? Does not hide in the shadows. He's got a gun on his sword, though. Surprise. Yeah, you're right, Jordan. I knew I didn't trust that fuck. But didn't he shoot while he was on the ship? Huh? He jumped off the ship and the ship blew up. Why does he shave his head if he wears a toupee? To fuck with us. That's on your clubby hands. He does sound a lot like David Tennant. Do you want <laughs> Scottish. Yeah. Behaving like a true gentleman. I'm so excited for these choreographers to do sword fight. <laughs> You've killed millions. <clears throat> He's got a gun. One more, for good measure. Fight! No! no! Shoulder! Oh, okay, it's shoulderish. People always look from that when the movies. Oh. Hit so hard, they're sparking. Come on, old man. Get up. I said, get up. So steady. Cool. I love these oh, shots. That's a neat cut. Sweet. Like literally on the battlefield. Yeah. Just a little bit of speed ramp there, but still looks so good. Jeez. The shields? Harley. Oh, man. Yeah, a gun. A, a grenade. grenade? Fuck this gentleman's shite! Jesus! Run, goats! That was pretty cool. Ring your bell. Mm hmm. Fuck's sake. <laughs> See, he won't die. <laughs> Three rats spilt him. Oh, oh on the cliff side, strikes. someone's falling. Mm. Roll the other way. That's why he doesn't have hair, coward. <laughs> Where's Angus's brother or whatever? Come hit him over the ledge. <laughs> oh my god, I think it might happen. <laughs> oh my god, you're right. It is! 
<laughs> it's the one horn. Vengeance! <laughs> okay, he didn't hit him over the ledge, but it's still close. Oh, the cashmere. You can't let me fall. It goes against your every belief. You are a pacifist. He's killed so many people getting in here, right? Yeah. Now completely reliant on your mercy, old boy. You're right. I shouldn't let you fall. Only now I have become the man that my son would have been. Jeez, that's such a far fall. Oh yeah. You ran out of breath. Around a scream before you hit the bottom. Oh, oh they went all the way down. <laughs> <laughs> Usually you don't follow all the way down. No. Take, take this, go home. So you jump in front of a bullet for me. And out of a plane. Not out of an airplane. So you would see. Thank you. So, hey, At least he understands what it's how like jumping out of a plane. <laughs> That's what I want to know. How do we get down? The elevator is destroyed now. There's a rope. There it's is not. A, it's at the bottom. There's of the a mountain. pile of rope on you top of Dupont. They don't have extra rope. No, they don't. First thing you they're go gonna up there, have to stay, stay up there rope. and weave rope out of all of that, <laughs> that cashmere. cashmere. Yeah. He's <laughs> gonna ask where it came from. We're going to war! When you're given a blessing like that, you don't... You don't ask questions. Yes. <laughs> We're going to war! He's like, he's not so happy. Yep. And I propose that we become the founding members of the Kingsman Agency. My code name will be... King Arthur. Arthur. And if you agree to join me, you may turn over your place card where you will find your own code name. Galahad. Mm -hmm. I am Galahad. There he is. I am Lancelot. I am Bedivere. I am Percival. Excellent. Merlin. Ah, there we go. This. Is oh, <laughs> I love that. May our sons and friends rest in peace. And long live the Kingsman. The Kingsman. They're standing really still. <clears throat> they, they froze it. Has a picture. The Kingsman. This young man come to rival your position in this world, my friend. It is an honor, Comrade Lennon. <sighs> and your name? Adolf Hitler. Oh, man, I was wondering. <laughs> huh. Hmm. It's kind of weird having, like, a after-credit tease of, like, who is it? Is Hitler. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> sure. I don't know. I don't know if I like or roll my eyes at the... Adolf Hitler. I don't know. <laughs> the Hitler thing? Yeah. I get it. I understand what they're going for. In yeah, they're setting like, up for the next... Yeah, no, I get you. Like, The King's <laughs> Man 2, or whatever. Which I would definitely watch, but it's just like, what's what we going to tease him with? Hitler. <laughs> He's like, it's like South Park riffing on the MCU or something. I don't know. <laughs> Maybe not. I'm probably just taking it to... Uh, I don't know what the right word is. But... Yeah. Loved the movie. Loved it. It was a lot of Had fun. A lot of fun. That was cool. I mean, it's it's a lot slower in the beginning because yep. there isn't a Kingsman sure. set up. Whereas like sure. the other ones, I feel like something happens kind of earlier on. Yeah, sure. And they and already they're... have this organization to like instant action kind of thing. Yeah, where they're just kind of figuring it out as they go along here. Some amazing set pieces. I think my favorite being the No Man's Land one. Like. From when he got there to getting on that mission, that like fight that everybody had to fight while like being hunkered down. The yeah. fight was interesting. Silently, all the way up until we find both, the spy. Like both groups being like, we can't shoot, yeah. or both sides will start shooting at yeah. us. And they both realize we can't shoot, yeah. or both sides will start shooting and we will all die. So we let's just stab each other mm -hmm. until someone wins. But then finding the spy, the hug, like the like the compassion that the guy had for him, and 
then carrying him all the way up until the bomb, and they're like, oh my god, he died, and then he didn't die, and then he was shot because of the, the lie. Yeah. I know. The it lie, was just a The hell lie of, that he created to get into the yeah. point that he thought he wanted to be in. It was just so, like that it's one crazy. set piece, from when he got there to when he died was insane. So yeah. I loved it. It was crazy. I couldn't believe it. That's, that they went all that way, and then he died anyway. I was... I was like, oh man, I thought uh, if he was gonna die, I thought he would have died already. Yeah. Obviously, he must have made it, and then they just killed him. Yeah. <laughs> it's like so cool, suddenly. Yeah. But I also I mean, really, I love the Rasputin fight scene me where like too. he's doing like this he Russian dance kind of thing yeah, almost. That was like, really cool. Like the one time when he was like dodging, he was like doing that kick thing back yep. kind of thing, and he's doing like these jumps and spins, and yep. it was just so cool. It's like the so... way they incorporated not just a yeah. fight but also like a dance. Into the entire choreography of it all. It was just great. So much style. Like, I just love it. I love whenever a fight can utilize different styles and pit them against each other rather than it's like two people that look and fight the exact same way. Sure. Like, styles like that make, make for such great gags. And this is probably some of my favorite, like, in terms of modern filmmaking, some of my favorite fighting I've seen. Yeah. Although, it's creativity. I have seen the opposite of that where two people fight very similarly. And it's awesome. It can it can definitely work. Like Princess Bride. Sure. No. Yeah. No. That can definitely work. I get you. But um, this was amazing. Yeah. Yeah. Like I don't know. I I I've always liked whenever you know, like when a superhero movie happens. Sometimes we have to get out of the way. They're like, well, this is just you, but evil, and they have the exact same power. And it's not as exciting as like, you know, like. You know, Spider-Man was Doc Ock. It's always exciting. Sure. <laughs> sure. Very so I like Spider-Man because most of his villains are very different. Yes. Yeah. Even Venom is very threatening, yeah. usually, unless you sure. watch Spider-Man 3. But usually he's yeah. very different and it's fun. Yeah. Uh, That's why Batman is weird. It's because all of his villains are also basically just dudes. Mm-hmm. They sure. are just dudes. <laughs> like, except for Bane, which, like... Uh, sure. Poison Ivy. Well, sure. <laughs> but she's very different and powerful. Yeah. But a lot of the other people like Joker's just a dude. Freeze is just a dude in a free suit with a gun. Sure. Like, yeah, I get you. Batman's just a dude in a suit. Two face is just a dude. Grapple hook. Yeah. Yeah. Even though like as he was speaking, I definitely got that David Tennant Scottish accent the entire time. I also thought it has to be more because why did they cast that guy? I had to sure. the guy was too for me, he was too famous to not sure. to be. The Morton guy? Yeah. So I don't know what what is he from? Uh, Watchmen, the the movie. He was Adrian Ozymandias, the main bad guy. Was he? Yeah. It's been so long since I've seen it. Hmm. I couldn't remember. Well, the main good guy. Matthew Good. Depending on your point of view. That's true. Sure. Save the world. <laughs> um, I mean, he's in a whole bunch of other things. I just know him the most and have seen that movie. I've definitely 10 or seen 12 times, so. his credit in things before. Yeah. Matthew Good. That's a very recognizable name what did we see him in recently it was something else that we saw and I'm like it's fucking Adrian they also just completely like you know they kept and kept and kept not showing his face that I'm like if it's it can't be anybody else but someone we've seen in the movie because if it is it'll it'll have to be like the craziest cameo in the world for it to live up to why we're not seeing his face sure it had to be fucking like Obama (laughs) <laughs> no, holy shit, they got him. Obama with a Scottish <laughs> accent. <laughs> You'd be shocked. I would but you be. know what I'm saying? Like, in terms of, like, it can't just be anybody, you know? Like, yeah. you know, there's going to be people that don't know David Tennant. They're going to be like, why was that just a big deal? It's a cool as David Tennant. Okay. You know? It's a big deal. Yeah. It's a big deal for us. It is a big deal for us. It's not for it, everybody. I guess. Does it make sense to hide his face for that long? Eric, it's s- just the reveal. I don't see anything that we've watched that he's been in. Hmm. Um, maybe it was maybe in, something I mean, that you watched. He was in the Jancy crown. Uh, <laughs> is yeah. that it? Is? Yep. Yeah. <laughs> He's in the crown. It's been me and Jesse watch. He's a photographer guy that marries into the uh, royal family. He's also in Downton Abbey. He marries the sister. Yep, that's it. Who's in Downton Abbey? I haven't seen that. Downton Abbey, he was uh, Henry Talbot. Oh, okay. I the clearly good wife. remember now saying, like, hey, it's the Ozzy Mendes. And her being like, what? Like, the guy from Watchmen. Like, I don't know who that is. Gotta watch Watchmen. Damn. So... So, okay. Who do we have? Did you give a look with the people at the table at the end? Was the, the guy? I don't know. The guy? I don't know. I felt like they were like, ah, oh, it's him. I was like, who are well, these people at the end that you're... I mean, one of them was uh, the Lancelot guy, obviously. But the other one was the guy that showed them the... Uh, 
the film, right? The other one? The film? Yeah. The uh, the guy in Which the... I can't remember his name. Who? Yes. Uh... The, uh... Oh, you mean the one from this movie? Yeah. Yeah. The one guy's from this movie. But there was the one guy with, like, the glasses. And you're like, ah, oh, it's him. And I was like, I don't know who he is. All right, go back to the guys. You just rewind, like, 30 seconds. You'll probably get there. Like, that guy. You're like, ah, oh, it's him. And I'm like, I don't, I don't know who that is. I mean, that's the guy that... That's Lance that's Corporal. Lancel, that's, that's the corporal that he took his place. Oh, that's Archie? And he yeah. came back, he said, call me Lancelot, and now he's Lancelot. Okay. And then, Man, he looks just looks different. Okay. And it's then, the mustache. Yeah. Sure. The guy on the far right. And then the one dude was... He's that bearded guy that I recognize from stuff, but I can never remember yeah. what all he's in. Me either. He's just a familiar face. <laughs> yeah. I just I didn't pick up that the other guy was Archie. I thought the other guy, the Archie guy, was going to be in it, but his name was Archie Reed. Is there an Archie in the future? I don't remember when the first Kingsman took place. Like, it's relatively well, contemporary, isn't it? The first one? Sure. Like, Arthur in that was an old guy. Like, could that yeah, have been... Yeah, is Michael Caine? I don't think any... Could that have been Archie? Archie? Would have been alive by No, the because he had a Cockney accent. He had a Michael Cockney accent. Caine. Yeah. Michael Caine was... Was he Arthur? Yeah. yeah. He was at the head of the table. Man, I'm picturing someone Stanley else. Tucci, that's his name. Yeah, that guy. Yeah, um, isn't he? Was he Captain America? Oh, he was a, he was a scientist, wasn't he? Was he the guy that created the serum? Is that him? And then who was the other one? Percival. Yeah, was that the king? That was the king, mm-hmm. right? That was George. It's, it's funny that the king is not Arthur. Someone else is Arthur. Yeah, and then the, the king, yeah, of England is Percival. But now it's interesting. Like this is, it was very different of a setup for what I was expecting it to be given that it's the Kingsman as a prequel but it is the very end is when you get the Kingsman everything else is yeah. all building up so I'm exactly. saying like, you know, it, it, it's not like the first usually you have like you have like the kind of not campy but like over the top spy movie stuff and then if you're going to deconstruct that then you get into the dark and the gritty and the like you know everything can't be you know light and fun we're about ready we're going to tell a movie here but instead we go the other way where we, we start out that way and we end up in the, the Kingsman uh, scenario. Yeah. Really yeah, bad. the very beginning was, you know, sad and, like, terrible. Like, yep. we have the concentration camps and this war in Africa that's going on mm-hmm. and then the, the mom dying and stuff and Emily, you know, and then dealing with all that and then it still is fairly serious going into, like, World War One and dealing mm-hmm. with that kind of stuff and the war. That time that, lapse of yeah. that city. The transition. Just pulling away and watching all the artillery shells amazing. hitting and yeah. And, and then the landscape, all the shells like just piled up, kind of like it's just a lot of like a lot yeah. of great impossible shots, like that a lot of being imagery an, an that was really good. shot to see. And then the uh, from the from Charles Dance through the porthole, through the water to the submarine, and then back you know, and through then the back, water, like to the it, those impossible shots that like you know those aren't real, but you're still you know they're still like punchy enough to really make you feel mm-hmm. yeah. like it. It was really cool. I did like that. And I and loved I, Shola and Polly too. I was like, they yeah. were really good, like helping like backup absolutely. characters and stuff. Yeah, I thought they were great. Yeah, I love seeing Shola like fighting Rasputin. <laughs> like that was so fun. It was really great. All the fights were just him, him like riding the rope up yeah. to cut that guy's head off. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I also you know sometimes especially in fights that are this involved, I, they did a great job hiding stunt doubles too. I thought. Sure. Yeah. I mean, granted, like all of their. Every, like what, like I said earlier, like it's all about style. Like all their silhouettes are so recognizable, recognizable, and yeah. like you know Rasputin. Like to put a stuntman in the Rasputin outfit, yeah, you're not going to recognize it's not. Sure, that it's guy. a big baggy you know. coat. Yeah, it's high collars. It's yeah. long hair. It's a big beard. Yeah, all like, the silhouettes put anybody are in there. really easy to do, but it just you know every once in a while you'll still see like that wasn't him. But I I was so engrossed in the fights I wasn't even thinking about sure. that. No, yeah. And there were parts where I'm like that's definitely Ralph Fiennes doing that is it or maybe they replace his head that looks like him I mean and they told, do crazy stuff nowadays I love the uh, first person view they had where it was like showing him back during his war days yeah. or whatever oh yeah and then it cuts to like the mirror reflection and like he looks so young and stuff too but I love the way they did like the stabs and the shoots and the then it comes up and it's yeah. like and then it goes back into his like mm-hmm. today form you know yeah it zooms yeah. into his eyes and you see the him losing parts of himself I thought yeah. it was really cool yeah that was good no, there's some really good stuff in this that I really enjoy. I really love the shot of when they're sword fighting on the table and the projector is, is there. So you're seeing 
the war tapes, but in the shadows are these crazy things that happen that decide what you know in this world yeah. that decide how the war goes. It's kind of like this. This war yeah. isn't it's. The, the pro- politics yeah. and the, the yeah. front of it all, yeah. but really what's happening is what's back here. This is really, really, really cool, really artistic. They're fighting in the shadows, and that's what decides it. Yeah, it's a neat idea to mm-hmm. kind of have that. And then the camera along the edge of the blade shots. That was so fucking cool. It was cool. really cool. I've seen that done before, but never like this close with that type of lens. Like I've seen it done before in like more like amateur fights that... Don't yeah. look as good. They don't look as good. It's a GoPro. I mean, yeah, yeah. This one looks amazing, but I just really appreciate a lot of the cinematography. <laughs> the mustache transition. <laughs> the mustache transition was hilarious. Oh my gosh, I forgot about that. You think mustaches like that will ever come back into style? They always say like fashion is you know and, and style like eventually repeats. Sam Elliott, dude, he's been no, I know, style but like I mean, like life. you know. Like it's, it's the president, style. you know, like sure. like everybody has a mustache. Just for like grow one, and it's in style. Not from like I, I'm not a trendsetter. No, I mean just you could be if it's a Although style. You, make you it have style. more of like I'm gonna start wearing fedoras again. You, you have more of a Hulk Hogan and it's mustache. Style. That's than how it like works. A, a big bushy. And Calvin wears this. Yeah, but not everyone wears that. But that's a style. Sure. But I make fun of him that. But I wear fedora. And I was like, oh. Look but this is actually like a, a, a current <laughs> style. Like, Can you know. shut up. The flat cap with buttons and stuff. Buttons. Like, I just started putting buttons on it because they were oh. cool. Like, I didn't know you had another button. Yeah. yeah you got buttons. Okay. Oh, you got more buttons. Jeez, I can't. Yeah. I never you never see me from I this never side. Seen I never seen that side. I always see the buttons. <laughs> They're great, though. Yeah. I love the Avatar one. The Avatar one's cool. And I have a Columbus Zoo one. Yep. It's like no, cheetah claws and is. puppy paws, I think mm-hmm. is what it is. Because science. Because okay. science. Okay. Mm-hmm. <sighs> Why'd you blow up that car? Oh, I enjoyed the uh, it, the the Ferdinand stuff was interesting to see, and uh, because we had also been dealing with it in a TV show recently, and we have the idea of like, oh, well, they threw a grenade, it bounced off. I'm like, what? That happened? Yep. And we look at them, like, oh yeah, that happened. Okay, yep. and then I'm like, okay, I'm waiting to see what they do. And they threw a, threw the grenade thing, mm-hmm. and it bounces off and didn't work. I didn't know it was off a. Umbrella. I don't know about that part, but yeah. And then, sure. like, well, later he was sitting at a, at a place eating a sandwich, and he just drove by, so he shot him. <laughs> it's like, what? That's what happened. His real assassination attempt didn't work, so he just lucked out and was able to kill the guy. It was ridiculous. And they they did kind of that whole idea yeah. there. But then, uh, I was curious on some of the other elements and stuff too. Like, what of it? Because I don't know a lot of the history stuff too well. I know like some of the general standpoints. I know war. I know that guy died. Everyone was mad. They fought. Yeah. But like, like were they all cousins? Is that a real thing? Like, I didn't, I've never heard that before. Surprise me. I don't Catherine know the if that's the case. Right? But I don't know. I just found I found that to be an interesting story. Beat. It would be whether it's true it or not. A, I'm like, that's like almost a silly dumb thing to to, to include and not be. Yeah, yeah, I know. It has to be true. I was just like, oh, that's yeah. interesting. But, my cousin, I mean, my cousin, my cousin. Is yeah. like, what? and then they're all feuding because they feuded his kids and sure. stuff. And I'm like, this mm-hmm. is crazy. And don't yeah. get me wrong, I'm sure. The funniest part, part is, is that they're all played by the same guy. I love that. I'm sure there's. Thousands of people right now screaming at their screens. Like, you didn't know that, but you know, sometimes we just don't know shit. As I yeah. say, as I say, it's, it's more important to to learn like trivia and facts and stuff like that than actual like relationships and family trees and stuff. I know and, a lot more. Star and keep in mind yep. than I do that we history. are in America and we don't have We're like done. the culture of uh-huh. Europe as much, mm-hmm. and our public education system kind of sucks. Oh, I wasn't going that far, but yeah, it probably does. And yeah, we defected from those guys over there. We don't care, you know. We did a, a bunch to like. They gave up Britain because off. they had so much more important shit to deal with. There was other war shit going on. And yeah, and... that's that's been our strategy the whole time. Is just yeah. bankrupt the people we're fighting. Ancient Russia. Anyway, no, I mean it, it'd be interesting if they do another one of these, like the King's Man Two. I would watch it. Like it's. This is a prequel. So we had the first one, and then we had a sequel to that one, and this one's a prequel. And then we're gonna have a sequel to the prequel. Yeah, it'd be a, it'd be it'd be like Borderlands. It'd be like Star Wars. Be what, like kind of. But remember, uh, remember Borderlands had the pre sequel, or whatever mm. it was. It was like they had one and yeah. they had another one, and they put yeah. one in the middle. So yeah. kind of like a pre sequel. <laughs> but I wonder, because uh, I mean, I like the Kingsman franchise, but I'm certainly not the biggest fan. What did I miss in terms of Easter eggs and? Connections. I'm sure it's a bunch. There was a bunch yeah. of quotes from, like, you know, Manners Make a Man. Yeah. Stuff I like got that, that. one. Mm-hmm. Yeah. But, like, when I wrote down Archie, I'm like, Archie, is that someone I should know? 
Like, whenever he's like, hey, you, what's your name? It's like, uh, you know, Lance, I don't know, whatever. It Lance was. Corporal. Yeah, Corporal, whatever it was. Archie like, Reed. Archie, Archie Reed. And I was like, should I know that name? The thing that should be mm-hmm. somewhere? Like, that's why I was wondering, like, who all was, like, Arthur and stuff back in the day? Like, yeah. him showing up as Lancelot. I'm like, oh, maybe he'll be, you know, Lancelot and stuff. And it's interesting. I thought Shola as Merlin, like... Like, is the glasses a thing they had to wear? Because didn't Merlin and the other ones have, like, those same glasses and stuff, too? But Sure. Yeah, but I don't all, remember Shola wearing the glasses the, beforehand. All the kings don't wear glasses, right? Do yeah. they all wear glasses? I guess they all even, wear those, even like... Even Eggsy that doesn't need glasses but, has but not, glasses not on. not the glasses. Not the round. I'm not talking about... You're talking about glasses in general. You and I wear glasses, but we don't wear the glasses. Mm-hmm. Like, he had on, like... Spectacle. The same ones I felt like Merlin wore yeah. in the future. Maybe not. Maybe he also had the newer ones eventually, too. It's been a while since I watched the first one. Mm-hmm. And now I miss Merlin. Yeah. You can watch those two again. No, I don't want to watch the second one again. The Merlin thing. I hate the line that I don't make decisions. the West Virginia song. I don't make decisions without my stomach full and my balls empty. Thank God dinner's being served. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I did like that one a lot. Uh, it was good. There were some really good lines. Yeah, uh, uh, as well as some really fun fights. and yeah. Just some really good shots and creative shots and stuff too that I thought were really fun. Yeah. Like I just, I, I did like, I liked a lot of it. I thought the goat was going to knock the guy over the cliff. I, I was hoping as well. But It would have been good. I guess it's okay that they didn't do that way and also let him make the decision to let go as well. So, mm-hmm. But I was like, oh, man, that goat that has that one horn, he's going to be so pissed at this guy. I hope he, hope he gets revenge. <laughs> yeah. And Eric's already mad. Like, kill this guy. Kill that goat. Right? <laughs> that was real Don't bad. Don't fuck with goats. Don't fuck with animals. Well, he's gonna, he probably makes it into food and cashmere now, right? I don't know what you do with goats. I never had a goat. I mean, to have a, a goat that you harvest the wool from, sure, you keep them alive. But you like, keep them alive. But now he can also eat it. Sure. What's his, what I mean, he, he has an elevator doing up there. The goats? Hmm. What was what doing up there? All the all the dudes. Oh, they got what are the goats doing up there? Eating. Yeah. <laughs> what the dog doing? <laughs> yeah, they keep the grass short. <laughs> sure. He doesn't have to mow. Don't have to mow. Man, carrying a five gallon tank of gasoline up that elevator would be terrible. I gotta fill up the mower. Oh, Dude, that whole thing. I'm. No wonder they got the one real big guy to just have to like push that thing around, right? That guy yeah. was a quintessential big, like mini boss guy. Crazy. <laughs> <laughs> he just picked him up. <laughs> <laughs> one single line. <laughs> no, he just yelled every time he got stabbed. Uh, yeah, it was great, Greg. That that's all you need. Mm-hmm. Like just a giant man to fight. Did and it makes it better. Kaiser Wilhelm really have a really small head? I don't, I don't know. Is that a real thing? I think, was, was, thing? I think he was rumored to have like a deformed hand or I something. I need to learn like more that. history. Or just watch a TV like, show based off of like, the crown. Like and they said like hey, my name is Windsor. I'm like, oh, oh, I know this. Wasn't there something like in, in <laughs> put, all of his photographs? I put Did Kaiser and it says, Did Kaiser Wilhelm have a deformed hand? Yep. <laughs> that was the first thing. I think like in all the photographs he like has it hidden inside of his jacket like yeah. this. And then yeah. like Napoleon started doing that because gotcha. he was like Maybe. He like admired his tactics or so, or something like that. Yeah. I can't remember. Wilhelm was born 27th of January, 1859, in Berlin, the eldest child of Crown Prince Frederick of Perugia mm-hmm. and Victoria, daughter Victoria. of Queen Victoria of the United Kingdom. A difficult birth left Willem with a withered arm, which he always tried to conceal. Gotcha. Take my strong hand. Well, cool. I like the idea, too, of also, like... While ha- having some, like, I don't know, fantastical fights and different things, like, pulling yeah. from, like, actual history sure. to, like, because yeah. mm-hmm. then I learn. That's true. <laughs> if they showed us movies like this in school, we would remember that. I would have remembered more history. I guarantee yeah. it. Like, a lot more. To watch any credit scenes, like, oh, Hitler! <laughs> <laughs> Can't wait to watch the next one! The teacher's like, what have I done? <laughs> So this took place in 19... Sorry. I guess it went through all the war, right? Yeah, yeah it went through likely. the First World War, which I'm guessing the next is going to be about World War II. That and would, that would make well, sense. is it going to be about World War II, or will it be like the in-between time? Because you got like, what, 20 years in between there? Maybe. Roughly? It's yeah. not quite 20. So Around. Yeah. <clears throat> From the end to the beginning. Um, I think we joined in... Is 42 when it ended, or is that when we joined? That's when we joined. Okay. I'm like 42 stands well, out. I'm trying to remember what it was. Technically, the end of 41. But so 42 is when we really got into it. Maybe that's going to be where they would go with the next one. And then we have to kill Hitler. And then we get to see how Hitler 
dies, you know? Like, we saw how Rasputin died. Like, there was the whole thing, like, they had to shoot him and yeah. poison him and drown him and all this stuff. And we, they did everything in one night. I thought it was, like, spread out over time. <laughs> but in this one, they did it all. You guys seen his, Inglorious ba- Bastards? I have yeah. not. You should see that. His his puke thing, when he's just like, all right, so you're blah! <laughs> like, it was just so right? sudden. Who did you come here to kill? I feel like blah. fighting Rasputin is like fighting like David Blaine. <laughs> <laughs> like he can like do that on command. He you, can like You stab in his drawing. face and he just swallows the sword. <laughs> <laughs> and, like, takes <laughs> Dude, his whole like... Because he, he was just a mystic. Like, like he was a yeah. magician that would destroy yeah. people and shit. <laughs> It was deeply uncomfortable watching him, like, with all of those crumbs and spit and stuff all over his face, just lick that guy's leg. Oh, <laughs> so, yeah, I know. Ah. They put you in such a like, uncomfortable mood. Yeah. You know? And the way that, <laughs> like, Orlando plays is so funny. <laughs> oh, oh, God! Oh, God! <laughs> but hey, you know what? It fucking worked. Yeah. Right? He got the blood to flow. His leg was better. He did. It was better. Miraculously. We, like, like, that man had some actual talent, but he was just not. He nice. was a bad man. I can just like imagine tigers. like the action and they're just doing that and then they just cut and then it's like what are we doing man <laughs> it's like at the or end of some laughing, of our videos where we just like what yeah. is that it's bit like, what the fuck are we doing it's like I don't know I think it'll work <laughs> I think it plays I let's do something plays. different just in case it doesn't work <laughs> it doesn't work we'll we'll oh that's funny alright well this one worked for me I enjoyed it I I, hopefully it had success and uh, yeah there's a Kingsman too I wouldn't mind seeing another one I'd like to see like I want that after credit scene to go somewhere I mean you also could just like not ever have anything, and it's just kind of sure. like, oh, he's also behind stuff and whatnot, you know. But it does set up like an arch nemesis for, you know, the Kingsman in the future as well. It's like, oh, who's the shepherd now? And I guess so, yeah. Because like it seems that the title is passed on to whoever is like trying to do this world domination shit. Yeah, I wonder if you watch if the ring can be seen to give you a clue as to who that is earlier. Because they showed that ring of that guy like two, three times, but it was always like when he was all shadowy and stuff. Sure. And I was like, is that going to be how we know who it is? Like, you come up and be like, hey, how's it going? Okay, nice to meet you. (laughs) It's really interesting, too, because I, I, you know, I I kept thinking, like, okay, it's probably going to be Morton, because they kept talking about cyanide, and I kept thinking of the other scene in Watchmen with cyanide, where a guy goes to assassinate Adrian, and you think, oh, shit, like, you know, Adrian can't be him. They tried to kill him. But Adrian, like, this uh, is a delivery guy that tried to kill him. But Adrian, like, the delivery guy tries to kill him, and he, like, oh, no, he has a cyanide pill. And he puts the pill in his mouth and kills him, <laughs> you know, <laughs> secretly. You don't find out until later in the, in the movie. So I kept thinking about that and then thinking about the actor and then thinking about Morton. That's a different movie. I know, but it's just so, it works so well. And then I was like, well, I won't say anything just in case, like, people can be surprised. And you're like, Morton! <laughs> I didn't trust the fuck. There was a mole. Honestly, I didn't think he was the shepherd for a long time. Yeah. I thought he was just the mole. Because sure. the shepherd said, I've got a mole. I was like, I don't trust Morton. Sure. It's Morton. Yeah. And then I thought he just jumped over, let the place blow up. Sure. But well, then it, as we got further and further to the end, I'm like, like the wait, timing, why are they still hiding his face? We never saw Morton again. Like, the timing yeah. didn't work for me because, like, he was on the, the bow of the ship, and then the next shot, we're inside, and then we do that, and then Shepard's supposed to be on the submarine. It's like, how did he get from the ship to the submarine? But I think because we skipped over that hour that he got in a rowboat and rode over there. Sure, because... Because he had just been handed that that yeah. Book. case of documents and yeah. stuff like that, and the 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 Lord had finished yeah. one of those folders sure. that was like that thick, so yeah. he had gotten over there. No, yeah, I time. wasn't thinking about that in the t- at the time. I was just thinking like, all right, well, yeah. it does seem weird that one, yeah. it's that actor, and two, he just kind of like went outside. And when we left. went out the hole, he wasn't like there. Yeah, like, it felt like he was like right there looking through, and then sure. we went out, he yeah. wasn't there. So I'm like, yeah. well, he must have jumped. But I didn't think that he was Shepard. Yeah. yeah, initially I, I just I, didn't trust him. And sure. I'm like, well, who's the mole? Yeah. Well, probably the guy that the general trusts the most yeah. would be the best mole. It's him. Sure. And I would have shot him like the other guy did to the guy who he thought was lying because he was. So you don't lie in the middle of war. You get turned into a spy. Yeah. I just really want to try out the mustache. Whenever I think I can get mine. Just grow it. Do I tr- it. I trim Shave this off. As, do it as thick as you can. Do start, just a mustache. Start now. Start pulling it to the side. If I get mine long over yeah. here, I can, like, twist them up. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Like, I trim the ends of mine because it gets annoying, and it starts, like... Especially if I have, like, uh, my fan going at night, like, they'll they'll reach up here and, like, tickle yeah. right here. So I, like, trim the ends off, but, yeah, I can get my mustache, like, really how do you, long. How do you get, like, Tom Selleck's mustache? 
Genetics, Is that man. Just, you just gotta come just, out of the right vagina. Get ready for it. Guys, thank you so much for watching. Hope you enjoyed it. Subscribe as we're going for a million subscribers this year. Yep. Uh, we also have a new movie every week that pops up here every on week. YouTube. And you can see it uh, as you subscribe because it's going to be here and you want to get a notification. Also, more available at Patreon uh, for movies and polls to decide movies. So lots of movie stuff and a train.